Hi everyone, so welcome back to our channel and today I will be sharing with you my review of the Belly Zero um, Bra which is by the brand Neywai So some of you all might have seen a lot of influencers like Janim and I don't know, I can't remember who else but many others who actually wore the brand's um, underwear, undergarments and all that and then, so actually that's how I got interested in it to ship to Singapore right, the shipping cost was probably like equivalent to buying one additional bra which I mean their bras are not that cheap lah I decided to try my luck and went on Taobao to find and lo and behold there's actually a Neiwai Tian Mao store so it's a turns out Neiwai is like a Hong Kong brand or like China brand or something like that but it was amazing and you know how Taobao they have like their deals and their coupons and all that so I was like oh my goodness this is amazing so I went to buy it and yes they are legit like Neiwai products so let me just show you so um okay so firstly the bra right there are like two types of bra so one is a spaghetti strap, strap one which is like this and then there is the like kind of thicker strap sports bra kind which is like that okay so some of you all might be wondering no like oh what's the whole rave about this brand uh, why is the bra so in demand so basically it's a one size fits all i don't know how or what technology they use i didn't really read a lot into it but basically um this bra can be worn by people with a to d cup sizes so what that means is that um like like the promise to you like is that oh you know as you go bigger or smaller the bra will adapt its shape and its size according to um, how you grow la, and at the end of the day you know it's comfortable um, because it's it, there's no underwire it's seamless as well not really seamless but like basically there's no underwire so it's not uncomfortable it doesn't poke on the under boom and all that so that's why a lot of people wear, wear it and buy it okay I bought this since uh, last year October and ever since it has arrived and I washed it I've been wearing it so much oh my goodness I'm not kidding you like I actually bought another batch of them lah even though they are quite expensive but I do think it is quite a good investment so firstly right it's super comfortable like the material I don't know you can tell but it's like those seamless panties where it's very soft it doesn't like wrap your skin and even after you take it out there isn't like you know those like bra marks and all that um one downside though is that the cups okay i don't know if it's a downside or not to you but to me i feel it is because the cups can be taken out and removed uh i actually don't like that because um after i take it out from the washing machine i had to like or shaken the cups and all that and uh, like, I'm quite lazy lah so anyway at the side of the bra there's a slit so you can just take it out um it is slightly padded it is not like like push up bras kind so yeah and actually I've not taken it out before yeah so all in all I really like it um it's really soft really comfortable um doesn't tuck on your skin and before I got pregnant and until now I've gained about like 20 kg so um, I believe this will work best for me like, at this point in time okay so on top of it's selling for 152 yuan uh, which when I divide by 5 is about $30.40 um, but of course with that there's, it's gonna be cheaper because usually there are like discounts during the sale period and all so you actually get them cheaper than 152 okay so between the thin strap and the thick strap right in the second batch, I actually bought more thin like spaghetti strap ones because I realized these are quite like sports bra kind where the back has, I guess it has more support lah but I, I don't really need that at the point I, I feel like the spaghetti strap one is sufficient so yeah, I guess it's really up to your preference you can try and see what works and um, when I do put these bras on though, I actually you know like when you put it on it, it will like scrunch up at the back or it will roll up then you have to pull it so so far when I've been putting on it, it even though the material is like thin but I've not toy I guess <laughs> but yeah so far other than that it's great it, I mean the colours are not super varied um, but they do have your dark colours, your more neutral colours and all and yeah so I actually got this I really love it so I bought more um, and then in the second round I also bought their 
belly zero underwear which is you basically using the same concept where you like the underwear grows with you lah. So this I was really shocked because they are really super thin. Uh, I would think they are comparable to seamless panties lah. So they are, uh, I bought it in a set of three. So there's this black. There's this like uh, dark purple maroon. And then there is this more like skin color looking thing. Yeah, so uh, they've been really comfortable. Oh my gosh, they are so thin, okay? Like, if you saw some of my previous haul videos, right? I bought like seamless panties as well because of the whole pregnancy. Um, and so this is like example one of them. I'm not sure you can see, but at the top, right? There's actually the seams or like a layer of seams. So sometimes it does still poke in, but it's not as bad as like regular underwear. But these belly zero ones, on the other hand, are like really seamless like when I put them on right I actually have difficulty like grabbing onto them because they are so thin and, like they are so stretched out and thin lah basically so I was really quite amazed and um yeah I all in all I do think they are a really good investment uh, considering the price I mean I don't know how long they will last me uh, but they have lasted me since October last year lah so actually how all this started right was because um on Taobao I actually bought this other brand of bras previously which are like seamless uh, also the seamless no underwire kind la. so can you see yeah so at the back it's seamless no underwire so they were really comfortable I've been wearing them for quite a while um, and I still wear them now la, like as compared to my other bras that have wires you know yeah so at the back are the regular hooks like this okay, so I'll leave the link to to all that I've spoken about in the description box so that if let's say you know the belly zero is too expensive for you or you know you are not ready to invest in this yet you can get this um this like non-branded ones lah. so these non-branded ones they also they have a slit in the middle um to be able to take out the bra cups so these ones right are slightly more padded um they have this little bump at the bottom that's like a more push up effect I guess but I honestly don't see much difference um, yeah and similarly after you wash this right you might need to like you know sometimes like the cup folds in and all so you need to like straighten them out when it's dry so it doesn't spoil the cup okay there's also actually the guys version of the Newa Belly Zero underwear that I bought for Chris but boys being boys right I guess they don't really like know the difference. I asked him, I was so excited. I was like, hey, how's the underwear? Like, comfortable or no? Like, is it nice? Is it cooling? He's like, oh, okay, lor. Waste my money. Like, I should have just bought more for myself. But anyway, so, oh yeah, so just to show, um, the under, the inside of the underwear has like this lining, this fabric lining. So, uh, I guess if you are cautious about like, whether the underwear will be itchy because of its sin synthetic material I guess then you can be assured that like you know at the inside it's a cotton fabric thing so um, it doesn't irritate your you know your sensitive parts okay so as I mentioned earlier right the bras that I got were like for A to D cup if I'm not wrong so what happens if you are someone with a larger cup size so um, there's actually a uh, a belly zero version for cup sizes from C to E so if you are on the larger cup size you can choose that but the thing is um, they only come with the thick strap versions they don't have the spaghetti strap ones which I guess because you know if you have a bigger cup size and you need more support so yeah um, one of my friend got the larger cup size one she says it's not too bad um, she would have preferred if there was a bit more support um, but I mean because of how this brand is designed right so it is comfortable but maybe if you want more support for it then it might not work so so well for you so just to share I shipped all this in when I was buying stuff from my using the third party folder I'm not very sure whether they ship via Thai now I have a feeling they don't because the other day I was recommending it to my colleague and she was using Thai now uh, and they didn't allow her to ship so if you're looking to ship this in um, you might want to explore third party folder options and if you, if you don't know how to use a third party folder um, we have a playlist uh, to 
teach you and to share with you my review and how I use third party folders. Lah. So I hope this video has helped you, you know, um, know that there are other bra options, good bra options out there on Taobao uh, that is actually really comfortable and affordable or like value for money as well. And if you like the video, don't forget to like, subscribe, leave us a comment and we'll see you in the next one. Bye!